Liberal National Party MP George Christensen has fired another shot at the federal government by threatening to resign. Insiders say the maverick Queenslander's commitment to the coalition appears to be up in the air as the fear of one nation's rise threatens to drive a wedge through the government. From Canberra, political reporter Caitlin Gribben. He's a serial objector. If it goes against, uh, you know, what the I believe the LNP stands for, I'll be voting against it. The Labor... Often at odds with his own side. Hey, George. Hey, George. Hey, George. The North Queenslanders again warning he may walk out of the coalition. He contemplated threatening to resign in a letter to the Prime Minister, citing his government's inaction in a dispute between a foreign-owned sugar mill and cane growers in his electorate. So George is the local MP. The ABC's confirmed George Christensen decided not to send the letter, but an LNP source says his commitment to the government is a day-by-day -day proposition. I know that George has, has said that he's, he's loyal to the National Party. I hope and I believe that George will be loyal to his nation and, and, and stick with a good government. But recently, he's only spoken about his desire to remain as a national. No mention of loyalty to the coalition with the Liberals. I've never seen any indication that he is anything other than a committed member of the coalition party room. I can tell you George Christensen's not going anywhere. But that's what coalition MPs were saying about Corey Bernardi before his decision to split from the Liberal Party last week. He too complained about the government's directions as those on the right try to fight the gravitational force of One Nation. Pauline Hanson's posing the greatest threat in regional Queensland seats like George Christensen's Dawson. But his threats are tiring his own colleagues. You've got to be a team player to be in this game. You can't win every debate you have. And if you do lose a debate, well, it's not the end of the world. With a one-seat majority in the lower house, house, the government can't afford to lose anyone. If George Christensen goes, he could join with the rest of the crossbench and Labor to block coalition bills. The Queensland MP knows he has the power to make life difficult for the Prime Minister, and that's exactly what he's doing. Malcolm Turnbull's had one of his best parliamentary fortnights in months, and this latest intervention appears to be an attempt to cast a shadow over it. Caitlin Gribben, ABC News, Canberra.